in the fall of 2019, Porsche unleashed its first ever battery electric vehicle with a Taycan, a release the Stuttgart firm has since followed up with a myriad of different model variants. And after previously pulling the cover off of 4, 4S, Turbo, Turbo S, and GTS specs of the car, Porsche has now revealed a more practical, yet still thoroughly capable, middle-of-the-road version of the electric car with the new Taycan Sport Turismo. Touted by Porsche as a practical all-rounder with on-road dynamics, the new model aims to fill the gap between the more utilitarian Taycan Cross Turismo and the more spirited Taycan Sport Saloon. The first all-electric Sport Turismo ever to hit the market, this new Taycan range will be offered in five different versions, the 402-horsepower Taycan Sport Turismo, the 523-horsepower Taycan 4S Sport Turismo, the 590-horsepower Taycan GTS Sport Turismo, the 670.5-horsepower Taycan Turbo Sport Turismo, and the top-of-the-line 751-horsepower Taycan Turbo S Sport Turismo, the latter of which can rocket from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 2.8 seconds and tops out at a tad over 160 miles per hour. The new range is also markedly more spacious, with a luggage compartment with 446 liters of storage space, plus 84 liters of room in the front. With the rear seats folded down, the turbocharged Taycan Sport Turismo can achieve more than 1,200 liters of real estate for cargo and luggage, too. Boasting a range of up to 305 miles, the Taycan Sport Turismo's battery can achieve an 80% charge, from 5%, in less than 23 minutes. What's more, just 5 minutes of charging affords the model 61 miles of autonomy. Other noteworthy features of the lineup include a new panoramic roof with sunshine control, an electronic glare protection system, an available Bose surround sound system, and optional remote park assist. Full specs and pricing have yet to be revealed for the Taycan Sport Turismo range, though Porsche has announced that the GTS spec is slated for a launch in February of 2022 while the rest of the lineup is scheduled to roll into dealerships the following month.